Maybe you got in that tanning bed because you missed your summer glow. Maybe you got in that tanning bed because prom was coming up. And you had to win Will back from Marissa. That thieving bitch. Right? That thieving bitch. Millions of teenagers use tanning salons every year. Maybe you got in that tanning bed because celebrities do it, right? Check out my tan. I mean, this tan. Check out this tan. Because if it actually was bad for you, it wouldn't be so popular, right? Right? Check out this mole. It's bigger than normal. Asymmetrical. It's the first sign of melanoma. Mellow what? Uh... Melodrama. Mitosis. No, that's not even close. Melanoma. It's a cancer. In your skin. It's dangerous. Not a joke. And it can spread. It only has to be one millimeter to get into your bloodstream. This big. <laughs> one millimeter? Dude, isn't that how big you're... Not funny. Not a joke. Melanoma is no laughing matter. Mela, know what I'm saying? What? What? Think the industry is on your side? It's not. Chances are, if you go to 10 different salons and ask them about the dangers of tanning beds, nine of them will give you inaccurate information. Eight of them will claim it's actually good for you. Five of them will deny any risk at all for fair-skinned individuals. Though people like me are the most at risk. So are people like me because black people can get skin cancer. This isn't to make you afraid. It's to make you aware. So skip that bed. Skip that bed. Skip the bed. Because no matter what great deal you find, the risk just isn't worth it.